I'm staying at my uh, my in-laws, my kitchen is being redone. They live at a very beautiful neighborhood and there's a waterfall right there. I thought I would show you something slightly different today. And it's actually something very important for us musicians, which is to make a schedule, a monthly schedule. Today I want to show you how I actually do it. So first I scatter for a location. I like a super blurry background so I can add the text on top of that. So I have a lens right here that compresses the background. It's the 85 millimeter, 1.8. So let's find the perfect spot. So I'm connecting to the Wi-Fi of my camera right now. I put a two second timer. I make sure the camera is level. So however you take your shot, you gotta remember that you're gonna put text over it. So you have to make sure you have a, enough space. It's time to take it to the computer and edit. What's up, brother? What's going on? Arriving home to find you here working tirelessly. Every day. <laughs> Every day. I think I'm gonna switch my YouTube channel from guitar to cooking shows after the, the job you're doing here in my kitchen. So I got my pictures here. Now I have to go through them and select the one. I'll be honest, I kind of like this one. So the next step is to export this picture by clicking export. All right, so the picture is exported. Go to Adobe Photoshop. So I'm gonna open up a calendar that I already used before. I'm gonna grab my file, my picture, and I'm gonna drop it on top of this one here. Then I'm gonna move my text to the side here. Let's change the color. I like to pull colors from the same image sometimes. The next step is to look at my actual calendar here. I actually have a new gig today, this, I mean, today, tomorrow. Tomorrow is Wednesday for me. So let's add this here. It's called, you know what? Before I add only one day to this place, let me text the venue manager. I'm just gonna see if he wants to already book another one, you know? And that way we already have both dates. I don't have to be doing edits to the calendar later. So he replied, and he's given me another date. How cool is that? See? All you gotta do is ask. Then you can go to filter and then you can click on render lens flare. Look at that. It just added more light here and a little flare in the guitar. Done. <laughs> That's how you do it. I'll see you in the next video. Arrivederci.